dolls and gents, I am super excited to be back tonight. You guys have been on me about getting this makeup tutorial recorded. It's the look from my November favorites video. I told you guys if that video got a thousand plus likes, I would do the makeup tutorial. And it did get over a thousand likes, so here's the makeup tutorial for you guys. It's a tillish, glittery, smoky eye. Well, not really a smoky eye, but it's a tillish, glittery look. It's birthday look number three for me. I'm not sure what I'm going to call it yet, but by the title, you guys already know what it's called. Hopefully I'll figure out something good because my mind is just like, what shall I call this? I've been doing a lot of till looks, I know, but I got a lot more looks coming for you guys. I just showed you guys how to do the eyes. If you want to see what's on my cheeks, my lips, or the rest of my face, I will have that in the description box down below. And if you want to see how I achieve this eye look, stay tuned. Step number one is to prime your eyelids with an eyeshadow primer. I'm using the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer in Sheer. This just helps our eyeshadow last all day and prevent it from creasing. Next, you want to grab your transition color. I'm going to be using Raven Beauty Cosmetics Artesian Eyeshadow. This eyeshadow should be a couple of shades darker than your skin tone. It's going to be placed into the crease area to add a little bit of depth, and it's also going to be used to help blend out the rest of the eyeshadows that we apply later. Next, grab your favorite dark matte brown eyeshadow. I'm using Raven Beauty Cosmetics Dark Truffle Eyeshadow, and we're going to apply this into the inner crease area. This is going to be used to add more depth and dimension into our eye. Now it's time for the Till Color. We're going to apply Darling Pigment from Sugar Pill. Absolutely love this. It's a gorgeous Tillish turquoise eyeshadow. We're going to place this all over the eyelid and we're gonna put glitter there next, so don't worry about if it's too neat. Now it's time for the fun part. We're going to apply a tillish glitter all over the eyelid area. And this one is from Glamamore Cosmetics. It's called Fabby Divine. And I'm also gonna be using their Love Potion, which is an excellent glitter adhesive. Champagne eyeshadow. To define our eyes a little bit more, I'm going to be using a Coastal Scent. This is their gel eyeliner in Raven. And I absolutely love this. I'm going to wing it out. If you don't like winged eyeliner, then you can just do it normal. But I love winged eyeliner, so I'm going to wing mine out. Next, I'm going to apply my eyelashes. I'm using number 43s from my local beauty supply store and also my Revlon Lash Glue. Love this stuff and it's absolutely disgusting around the top. I've got to get another one of these. Uh, 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 
Now I'm gonna apply my favorite black eyeliner, which is Max Feline Eye Coal, all on my bottom lash line. And then I'm gonna smudge Sugar Pills Magpie Pigment right underneath it. And it's just a gorgeous navy blue eyeshadow, and we're also gonna bring it right under the wing eyeliner. Lastly, I'm going to add a highlight to the inner tear duct on my eye. I'm using a Jessie's Girl pigment. I'm not sure what the name of this is because it doesn't say, but I will have that listed down below for you guys. Here's the completed look you guys. I had so much fun recording it for you. If you guys enjoyed the tutorial, don't forget to thumbs up this video and also comment down below. Bye guys!